for 10 days and I've slept with 22 seriously people in oh my god in that 10 days <laughs>what's up good people welcome and welcome back to my youtube channel it's been days i've been trying to figure out something some content to do and i just came i just came along these cringiest videos like they they are actually i've been wanting to do reaction videos but it wasn't that tempting and that encouraging but when i watched these videos oh my god I don't know how I'm gonna say you don't know what to expect like they are so cringe they're gonna make you cringe gross out like they don't oh my god like they are so wicked I am speechless they have all type of shit inside those videos like when you listen to them like these girls are just spilling out some god, I don't know what to do to them but this I don't know what to expect Let's just react and see these videos because I saw just half of it and it is so sad. And that's why I gave this video a title, Why Men of This Generation Don't Want to Get Married. Because when they watch these videos, imagine me watching this video and I cringe to that extent and I gross out to that extent and I all that shit. How about somebody telling you like directly, like, I'm telling you this, like, let's just watch these videos. And I understand that you're pure. Yes. Tell me why being um, intimate with a guy grosses you out or freaks you out. Like, I don't like semen. Shocking. Shocking. I love how you respond. Like, she goes, I like semen. Be so honest about this. I don't like semen on my hand. I don't like... I'm like kind of gr grossed out about it. I'm so you've German. seen it before? Yeah, I've seen... <laughs> yes, I've seen it before, yeah. She's a germaphobe. I just like to cuddle. Something wrong with cuddling? Something wrong with cuddling? Yeah. Yeah, I've seen this video. This girl... She's actually pure. And she doesn't like semen. I don't know what you get from this video. That's weird. That's very weird. But when you keep watching this, you will get the reason why men don't want to get married. Because when you meet a pure girl, like this one, she don't like semen. And when you... Oh my god, let's just get right. Let's just keep watching. A 23-year-old woman has just been arrested for having a little too much fun with a 17-year-old boy. We are now speaking with the 17-year-old victim, Krishna Sahai. Me the victim? You should have seen what I was doing to her, though. Like, the last thing I was was the victim. Actually, this is just a, a little boy messed around with a girl. And you've heard what he has said, like, Me the victim? You should have seen what I did to her. Like, It's about to go down. <laughs> I left my boyfriend and I've been traveling for 10 days and I've slept with 22 seriously people in oh my god in that 10 days did you hear that I left my boyfriend <sighs> so disgusted oh I know what is wrong? Send help. Send help, dear. Send help. God. Imagine. I've left my boyfriend in that. I cannot even say. I cannot even say that. Like, it's me. This is so tough. I need water. The first. Get, I just can't get this straight. I left my boyfriend.
for 10 days and I have whatever with 22 people in 10 days. How the heck does that even happen? Look at her, like she's so beautiful, still young. You can just see from the face, the body, like, oh my God. What is wrong with our society? What is happening? What is going on? Somebody send help. Let's see what she has to say. My goal was 20 and I... So she had planned this. My goal was 20. Oh my god. No, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to get it straight. She's the one who left the boyfriend. It's not even the boyfriend who left her. So what, what, where the anger from? Like, this is just... Disgusting! I don't know. I'm feeling just like... And they hit 22 this morning. It's 1 p.m. now here in Paris and I need to check out because I'm going home. I really doubt I'm going to get another one on the board. Sorry, what? What is all... Sorry guys, I really doubt I'm gonna get one on the board. God, your goal was 20. It's now 22. What the point? What the point? I just don't get it. Man, let's just keep moving. So I am speechless. Either on the plane or like on my layover. So I think 22 is where we're going to cap it out. But how did I go? And she goes, How did I go? The audacity. The audacity. <sighs> this is so. It's disgusting. This is so wicked. This is so wicked. I kind of regret being with her, but at least um, it's on social media. Like you don't have to believe everything you see, but those words are so harsh. They are so. I don't even have a word to use. Let's watch this. The second girl with another bunch of crap. I don't know if you gotta like it or hear it, but let's just watch. Past runs so bad, but my boyfriend just wants a monogamous relationship. Are you for real? My boyfriend just wants a monogamous relationship. That's the reason why men don't want to get married. My boyfriend wants a monogamous relationship. Oh, poor man. I'm so sorry for that guy. I'm just... You saw how she started, like... So bad, but my boyfriend... I want to be passed around so bad. Oh, my God. And the boyfriend wants a monogamous relationship. Oh. Man. Sorry. Okay, let's see. Just wants a monogamous relationship. It's 2024. Expecting to be with one. Uh, 2024. I thought even this video. Oh, oh, oh. We are losing it this year. 2024. For your entire life is like unreasonable. I'm like young. Sorry, what? What is so unreasonable? Oh 
I might. Young eight-year-old Latino. I'm trying to get my face blasted. Don't even mention Latino. You are ruining the the name of the Latino people. You could just say you. Don't don't use even that name. Just say your name. Like how the heck should we know you are Latino? You're, imagine 18 years old. This, this is so by multiple men. Like I haven't even had a cookie in about I am disgusted with Did I get that straight? From stall. I have so much to live for. And you're telling me that I have to stay with this one guy because I love him so much. But there's literally So what's the point of love? What is love? Like should I start teaching love or <sighs> This is making me so uncomfortable. I cannot sit well. My I feel like my shirt is just eating me up. It's, it's so itchy. I can't I can't even handle this. I can't Oh. I just keep watching. Guys out there with 13 inch meats. No, God, please, no, no, no. Imagine this is so painful. Imagine those hearts, those ones are so harsh. These are so harsh. I'm just thinking of that one boyfriend who wants a monogamous relationship with this kind of girl. Like, it's so painful. It's so painful. A moment of silence. Waiting to destroy me. Hell no! Hell no! What? What the fuck? Can you see it? Let's just move on to the next one because the previous one is the worst thing I've ever watched in my life. The worst, the worst things I've ever had that they made my ear broken. I don't want. I don't want. Let's just. Move. So I wanted to go f my ex real quick, so I drove down to the Damn. gas station, let him cream pie me, and then I came home to sneak into bed. My boyfriend woke up and then wanted to f me, and he started. Just shut up. I am. Disgusted. The moment she goes on, the mom, the worst it gets. Oh, somebody sobs, and she's on a radio talk. Imagine, imagine hearing this straight, straightforward, looking at her face. How can you even react? How can you even react to that? How? How? Like. Cream pie. I don't mean, I don't want to get those words in my mouth. It's so itchy. It's so itchy. It's so itchy. Oh, my headphones. This is so so disgusting. Oh, I know. Eating me out and told me how good my tastes. <laughs> One thing that pisses me off. Is that girls who are talking this kind of shit were they're so beautiful look at look at this girl just look at her face she has this good face look at her, eight, her eyebrows just oh my god 
why did God has to create these beautiful creatures with these dirty minds? So destroyed. This is so. Girl, you're so beautiful. Why do you have to talk like that? I'm just concerned with these men who date these kind of girls. How do they feel like when they are told such such words directly? Like, they're sitting next to a girl and she's like, Ah? Uh ah? -huh? Ah? Uh -huh? Hands up. It's just me. My ex has come out of me. But I am totally disgusted. Yes, see, just see her, just see his reaction. Like, he's like hearing such for the first time. Man. I, I, I pity men all around the world. Like, how dare you? Like, you can see his reaction. He's he's just speechless. Like <sighs> send help. Mind me, these girls are so beautiful. Look at this one. She is such a beauty. Like you can see, you can, you can just just look at the lips. How cute she is. The hair, the makeup, just a ten but what is coming out of her <laughs> what is one thing that you've never told your ex that i dad and his brother and his cousin God. did i hear that told your ex that i dad and his brother and his cousin. And look at the audacity, look how she's smiling, like... <laughs> she's acting like she's, it's an achievement, like... I really hate this. Look, look... Look at her. <laughs> she's just... Yeah, yeah. not funny but how she's uh, she's the facial expression while she's saying those hard words those words like <laughs> it's not funny but yeah what happened um they just wanted to me so i thought it was hot and that's weird I am disgusted. The more she talks, the more you get pissed. Like, I thought it was a heart. And she's just smiling, girl. Are you even serious? Like, that's, that should be a secret. That you did such things, you should not even be proud of those. Of them, like just gone. <laughs> Something <laughs> that is kind of cute. I hope. That was hot, and I just piss somebody off. <sighs> I like cheating on him, so. I... Yeah. I like 
cheating on him. Remember the other guy who said, I want a monogamous relationship. Like, some men just are just suffering for no, no reason. Like, why would you even date a girl like this? She, a dad, cousin, him, brother, the whole family. And she likes cheating on you. And you're busy dating him. This is so... The wicked society we are living in. I just can't get enough of it. I just can't get enough of it. <laughs> Yeah, we used to cheat on each other. So, out of all the family members, who the best? Um, his dad. What the f? I am disgusted. Pissing me off. The audacity she has, like, his dad, brother, cousin, and she's just smiling, like, The whole family. So like the dad. It's because I like cherry. This is how we just get to know how pe other people do were raised and they don't have manners. Like how can you say such words with that audacity and you just smiling, your eyes are just glittering like you have is an achievement. I cannot even say such. Oh my god, oh my god. This shit is real. Let's keep watching. He's, she said his dad. And she she has been, if you have noticed, she has been smiling the whole, just the whole process, the whole conversation, just smiling, smiling. God. You know? Yeah, we used to cheat on each other. So, out of all the family members, who the best? Um, his dad. He's smiling, just... <laughs> he used to cheat on each other. Out of the family members, who the best? You don't want to be like this. This is disgusting. This is awful in every... Actually, not with them, but I've done that before. The more she talks, the more the worst is the worst, worst year it gets. And this, the the interview, the interviewer, the interview, interviewee. Am I getting the word right? The interviewee is just going on with the questions and the questions. Oh my God! Give me a break. She actually knew what to ask her, but that is too much. Like, um, brother, father, and cousin. I think this girl, when she, she dates you, she will go for your family. Like, if she dates her brother, the brother... He will look for she will look for the cousin, the dad, the uncle, the nephew, nieces, and all the rubbish around the family and smash. This shit pisses me off. But just let's keep going and see what these body girls have to say about this. <sighs> <laughs> She's laughing. <laughs> Was it out of family reunion or something? No, it wasn't. I picked them up at um like a bar club lounge place and well I was like initially talking to the dad. You have seen guys, you have seen how these girls I even don't know what to say about 
like they are just so they have the audacity to say such words in front of people and just, just like <laughs> it's an achievement i've seen the last girl how she's smiling and you saw the you saw the the second girl the first second the second and the first they were so proud that they <sighs> Anyway, thank you guys for watching and please remember to subscribe and this video is not aiming at discriminating or I'm just trying to pass the message like why men don't get married. You, you can be dating a guy and whenever you call him, you call him your, hu your husband is like, you know your husband? You can see from those videos like when men, such men watch these videos, they are turned off and they are just like some fear girls so you can see the reason and it's so wicked our society is so wicked just pray for this generation and just pray for this generation that's all i can see pray for this generation and let's let's try to avoid acting like we are achieve we have we have achievement in such weird things Anyways, thank you guys for tuning in. I'm gonna see you guys in the next one. And please remember to click the subscribe button and like the video so that the algorithm can can show it to other people and like, share. And thank you for tuning in. See you guys in the next one. Bye.